Your string, the yaw string, also known as a slip string, is a simple device for indicating a slip or skid in an aircraft in flight. It performs the same function as the slip skid indicator ball, but is more sensitive and does not require the pilot to look down at the instrument panel. Technically, it measures side slip angle, not yaw angle, but this indicates how the aircraft must be yawed to return the side slip angle to zero. It is typically constructed from a short piece or tuft of yarn placed in the free air stream where it is visible to the pilot. In closed cockpit aircraft, it is usually taped to the aircraft canopy. It may also be mounted on the aircraft's nose, either directly on the skin or elevated on a mast, in which case it may also be fitted with a small paper cone at the trailing end. They are commonly used on gliders but may also be found on jet aircraft, especially fighters, ultralight aircraft, like sport aircraft, autogyros, airplanes and helicopters. Its usefulness on airplanes with a tractor configuration single propeller at the nose is limited because the propeller creates turbulence and the spiral slipstream displaces the string to one side. The yaw string is considered a primary flight reference instrument on gliders, which must be flown with near zero side slip angle to reduce drag as much as possible. It is valued for its high sensitivity and the fact that it is presented in a head-up display. Even the most sophisticated modern racing sailplanes are fitted with yaw strings by their pilots, who reference them constantly throughout the flight. History The yaw string dates from the earliest days of aviation, and actually was the first flight instrument. The Wright brothers used a yaw string on their 1902 glider tied on their front-mounted elevator. Wilbur Wright is credited with its invention, having applied it concurrently with the movable rudder invented by his brother Orville in October 1902, although others may have used it before. Glenn Curtis also used it on his early airplanes. Operation In flight, the rule to remember is simple step on the head of the yaw string. The head is the front of the string, where the string is taped to the canopy. If the head of the yaw string is to the right of the yaw string tail, then the pilot needs to apply right rudder pressure. If the head of the yaw string is to the left of the yaw string tail, then the pilot should apply left rudder pressure. Or think of the attached point of the yaw string as an arrowhead pointing to the rudder pedal needing the application of pressure. According to Helmut Reichmann, rudder against the string and slash or aileron toward the string. In a spin, the string always points to the inside. To center the ball on an inclinometer, apply rudder pressure on the side to which the ball is deflected. Use the simple rule, step on the ball to remember which rudder pedal to press. Use on powered aircraft. Your strings are also fitted to the Lockheed Humanist to high altitude surveillance aircraft. A flat spin caused by excessive side slip even in level flight happens much more easily at high altitudes. Some light twin-engine airplane pilots place your strings on their aircraft to help maintain control in the event of an engine failure, because the slip skid indicator ball is not accurate in this case. In a multi-engine airplane with an inoperative engine, the centered ball is no longer the indicator of zero, side slip due to a symmetrical thrust. The yaw string is the only flight instrument that will directly tell the pilot the flight conditions for zero side slip. Your strings are also used on some especially smaller helicopters. Side string A variation of the yaw string is the side string used in gliders for a determination of the angle of attack. In this way the best L slash D speed, the best thermaling speed, and the stall speed can be measured independently of all parameters like air speed, all up weight, acceleration due to turning or stick movements and gusts. Investigations of the side string and on its use in glider flight were performed from the Akaflig Cologne.